Hey, my friends, welcome back to Tuesday with Tasha. I know that everyone loves, loves, loves their birthday. My daughter's birthday was this past weekend, so I thought it'd be wonderful to read about birthdays. We're going to read How to Have a Birthday, written by Mary Lynn Ray, illustrated by Cindy Derby. How to Have a Birthday On the morning of your birthday, you can tell already that the day is not like others. Maybe you wake early, wondering what will happen. You know something will, and that's your first present. You get to wonder. There may be whispered plans. There may be... who knows yet. At breakfast, you might be given a crown because your birthday is to celebrate that you are here. It's to tell you that you matter. People may sing to you, or you can make up a little song and sing it to yourself. You don't have to wait for someone else. A birthday is the first day too. You can try out how it's different being one year older. And on your birthday, there will probably be a present wrapped in special paper. Or there may be lots. Though sometimes the best one is knowing the whole day is yours. Because wherever you go, your birthday goes with you. To remember the day, it's good to have pictures. Even if it means remembering that haircut you'd rather forget. Or when you had to wear what you said you wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't. If every year you do something the same on your birthday, then you have a tradition. Or every year you might do something new. That can also be a tradition. Or you might just wait to be surprised. Because something always happens anyway to remind you what the day is. And then you feel again that shivery feeling that belongs only to a birthday. The one rule for birthdays is that everybody gets one. Though just one. Every year. There's also this birthday cake. So don't forget to practice blowing because all year you're growing toward another candle. And then it's time to close your eyes and wish. All year you can think about your wish, but on your birthday, you get to make it. After that, you have to wait and see. Almost anything could happen, but what's for sure is that your birthday is all yours to unwrap. I love this story, friends, because it's so cool to feel like we have a day that's all for us. Maybe some of you are twins or triplets or even more than that, but you still have that one special day. And it's so special because that's the day that we came to this earth. That's the day that we started being us. And that is a special day for everybody. So if you love this book as much as I do, click the link in the description box so you can get a copy for yourself. Don't forget to like the video and please subscribe to the channel. I am so appreciative of all my wonderful, wonderful subscribers. It keeps me coming back to read wonderful, wonderful books with you. So I'll talk to you next week. And if it's your special birthday day today, happy birthday to you. Today is your special birthday. So I hope you're doing all of these things mentioned in the book and you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.